Logan Paul, the very first YouTube sensation and celebrity that consistently makes the headlines. Whether it's being a nuisance to his neighbors, or shooting a YouTube video in a Japanese forest with a dead person in the background, and essentially being cancelled to re-emerge for a comeback and fighting one of the all-time greats, Floyd Mayweather. To being exposed by a YouTube investigator, CoffeeZilla, for scamming his audience with a crypto token called CryptoZoo, to becoming a WWE superstar, and starting a wildly popular podcast called Implied plausible, to being a co-founder of the popular disgusting drink called Prime, to going down as the worst egotistical brother anyone can have. There's no denying that Logan Paul is all gas and no brakes, but for the first time ever, Logan has some serious competition in the mindfuck game. Logan Paul is announced to fight a Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu world champion, Dylan Dennis, which is deemed odd because Paul aims to be seen as a legitimate boxer, but is fighting a Brazilian jiu-jitsu fighter. To sell any show, you need to captivate the audience and grab people's attention, and that is exactly what Dylan Dennis has done. By crossing a line of shit-talking by bringing in Logan's fiance, Nina Agdahl, into the conversation. Dylan Dennis retaliates Logan's shit-talking by posting images of Logan Paul's fiance with various men over a span of three days on Twitter. The Danish model immigrated to the US at the age of 18 and has hit the streets quickly dating celebrities like Adam Levine from Rune 5 to Max George from The Wanted to Wolf of Wall Street actor and playboy Leonardo DiCaprio. Once she passed through the musicians and actors, she moved on to the rich trust fund babies like Jack Brinkley Cook, the son of supermodel Chrissy Brinkley, until she moved down the totem pole, ultimately landing on YouTuber Logan Paul's dick. Um, my gag reflex is pretty strong. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I have to say, it, okay. it'll take, it'll take, okay. take a long <laughs> Okay, okay. Yeah. Wait, you went All further. Right. These were just the confirmed relationships she's been in, but Dennis wasn't satisfied and began dropping even more photos indicating that she possibly gets passed around like a used condom. Photos of Nina began emerging with Jamie Foxx, Ja Rule, LeBron James, a bunch of rich men and a list goes on. My God, this looks bad. There's no telling how many men she's been with, but to be fair, there's no telling how many women Logan Paul's been with, including his own brother's girlfriend. So let's not forget that. As exciting as the fight will be come October, we have to ask ourselves, where do we draw the line when it comes to competition? We've seen it get ugly with McGregor and Floyd, we've seen it with Logan and now business partner KSI, and we've seen it with Tyson in many legendary fights, but even Tyson, even Mike Tyson, the guy with the tattoo on his face, drew the line somewhere. Roshan, I want your heart, I want to eat his children. Praise be to Allah. And of course, if you love satirical, Pop culture humor, as well as political humor, I am the channel for you. 92% of you have not subscribed, according to my analytics. So please, just smash that subscribe button. That's all I ask. So until next time, you're watching HBO. Thank you for stopping by. And make sure you click that subscribe button. Until next time, peace out. I don't know what this is, but peace out.